My grandparents were Germans from Russia. North Dakota is a very common state for Germans. Germans traveled the United States and picked North Dakota for its climate, farming, and labor work. Fast forward to today and their grand and great-grandchildren are celebrating their heritage with music, dancing, blacksmith work, accordions, and of course by eating the traditional foods. Come and get it! You're late, you don't get nothing. There's so much history and heritage and cultural habits and norms with the foods and today there's just so much history and culture that's rich there. And I think it just brings people back to those times when they were younger and they actually um, spent time in Germany. A lot of these people actually came from Germany over here, um, speak fluent German. Und hier kann man auch Deutsch lernen. That means here one can also learn German. But a few words weren't the only thing I learned. Maybe like a spirit inside of us, you know, just something about our culture that calls us to yodel. So I thought I'd tap into my German side and try it out. A little better. But maybe I'll stick with my day job. All the festivals, no matter which heritage, remind people where they came from. It's touching and touching back to your roots. We have to all remember we're all we all come in from different countries into the United States, and it's amazing how we can all get along. We all kind of blend together, and uh, it's, it's refreshing and nice to see this uh, tradition going on. In what felt like Germany, but just in Fargo, Christy Larson, Valley News Live.